Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu Alaikum. I hope you all are fine and staying safe and happy. I am your science teacher, Ms. Farheen, and I welcome you all to your science class. So, my dear students, today we will start lecture number four of chapter number two, microorganisms. But before that, let's quickly recap what we have done in the previous lecture. For that, you have to answer the questions quickly. Listen to the questions carefully. Pause the video and answer the questions. How many general groups of microorganisms are there? Very good. Can virus survive by themselves? Excellent. So my dear students, today all the students will be able to identify the main groups of microorganisms and give examples for each. So we are discussing about the main groups of microorganisms. We have already discussed about virus. Today we will discuss about bacteria so in today's lesson general group of microorganisms bacteria in specific will be discussed we will discuss about the shapes of bacteria round shape rod shape spiral and comma shape so these are the different shapes of bacteria just amne virus ki different shapes ke bare mein discuss kiya tha where it is found how it looks we will also discuss about bacteria in the same way. So, my dear students, bacteria looks like this. This is a rod-shaped bacteria. It's the or be different shapes. Hoti hai. And uh, let's move forward towards the pre-reading question. So, what do you know about bacteria? Bacteria ke baare mein aap kya jante hai? Naam aapne baut suna hoga. It causes diseases. No, it not just only causes diseases. Uh, baut saare bacteria disease cause bhi karte hai. But not all of them. There are also some friendly bacteria. Some of them are present in yogurt. Uh, but we will discuss it in detail. We discuss karenge. We will perform a separate experiment on yogurt making. That how bacteria is helpful in making yogurt. And uh, yogurt is extremely good for our health. So my dear students, I swear by what you see and what you do not see. So Allah Ta'ala is saying that there are some things that you can see and that you can't see. So Allah Ta'ala has made some of the things that have been made, even microorganisms. So this is Allah Ta'ala's power that Allah Ta'ala has made some small things and some things that have been made from them and some of them have made some of the disadvantages. So my dear students, now quickly open page number 23. We already discussed about the three types of microbes, virus, bacteria and fungi. हमने वायरस को ऑलरेडी डिस्कस कर लिया है टुडे वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट बैक्टीरिया सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट विद द रीडिंग बैक्टीरिया दिस इज गिवन ऑन पेज नंबर 23 दीज आर यूनिसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिजम्स दे आर नीदर प्लांट्स नॉर एनिमल्स दे आर कॉस्मोपॉलिटन इन नेचर दैट इज Present, uh, present in all types of habitat. Examples are Vibrio, Cholera, Mycobacterium, Tuberculosis, Streptococcus, Pneumonia, Helio, uh, 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 Helicobacteria, uh, uh, Bacter, Pleuro, Pleurori. So my dear students, there are different types of bacteria. Uh, which have different shapes or in ke jo hai wo mukhtalif jo hai tarikhe se ye kuch jo hai ye uh, disease cause karte hai some of them are healthy so my dear students now look at the shapes of bacteria different bacteria have different shapes like uh, vibrio cholera bacteria are comma shaped mycobacterium tuberculosis bacteria have a rod shape streptococcus pneumonia bacteria are round and shaped other bacteria known as Helicobacter pylori have spiral shape. So these are the shapes of bacteria, round, rod, spiral and comma. So in shapes mein aapko bacteria jo hai wo, agar aap usko microscope ke niche dekhenge to hume kuch jo hai ye, these are some of the shapes of bacteria which are present around us. So now let's have a look at the bacteria's round bacteria. This is the round shape bacteria. This is rod shape bacteria. 
This is spiral shaped bacteria. And this is comma shaped bacteria. So four shapes jo hai wo humne uh, study ki hai bacteria ki. Now let's move forward towards the practice. So my dear students, how are bacteria different from viruses? Bacteria jo hai ye viruses se kaise different hai? Bacteria are not plants, not animals. They are cosmopolitan in nature. They are found almost everywhere. In any habitat, they can survive. And they are unicellular. They are living even outside the cell. They don't need a living body to survive. And um, then what you need to do is draw the shapes of bacteria causing tuberculosis, pneumonia and cholera. Label each shape properly. So my dear students, we have seen a lot shapes of bacteria. Ki. Even we had a look at the tuberculosis, pneumonia and cholera. You have to draw these shapes draw karni hai, aur unko properly label bhi karna hai. Also color them, they will look very nice. So pause the video and complete the worksheet. I hope everybody has finished it. Submit it to your teacher and then we will move forward. So my dear students, for evaluation, listen to the questions very carefully and then answer the questions. Quickly tell me why are bacteria cosmopolitan? Because they are present almost in any kind of habitat and they are not plants, not animals. Name some shapes of bacteria. Round, comma and rod shaped. Very good. So my dear students, now is the time to note down your homework. Quickly note down the homework. For homework, you will do section number D, question number 6 and 5 on page number 34. These two questions. Are viruses living or non-living? We have already done question number 5. We will do question number 6 only. Describe the shapes of bacteria. Okay, now we have different uh, shapes of bacteria. Ki. Write down the name of each shape and then describe it how it looks. Konse bacteria mein ye shape jo hai ye present hoti hai. And then we will move forward towards make different shapes of bacteria using play dough. Attach them on a disposable plate. Label each shape as well. So another homework that is given to you is ke aapko play dough se jaise aapne viruses ke model binaye te. Similarly make models of bacteria with the help of play dough. Play paste it on a disposable plate. Then cover it with a transparent sheet and present it in your class. So this will look very nice. Also label underneath it ki aapne kaun sa bacteria banaya hai, kaun si shape you have tried to make. So my dear students, from here we will move forward. So my dear students, today what we have learned, today we learned that mycobacterium tuberculosis bacteria have a rod shape. Bacteria are unicellular organisms. And in the next lecture, students will learn about the preparation of yogurt. So in the next lecture, we will perform an experiment today, today in this detail. We have discussed about different shapes and what is bacteria, how it looks. So my dear students, in next lecture, yogurt preparation will be experiment. Hoga. You will love this experiment. Keep everybody around you safe, uh, safe. Have a good day. Thank you so much and Allah Hafiz.